Gotta get my ritualistic pre-challenge coffee. Not quite as good at this eating lark as I once was. So I gotta warm up the old pipes a bit. Anyway, this is the challenge on today's agenda. You'd have to say the, uh, the artwork is not particularly compelling. Luckily, it doesn't take much to get my attention. So let's chart a course for the Lord Rodney. Sounds a bit posh. It's in Keithley though, so surely not. <laughs> Here we are, the Lord Dave, I mean, Rodney. That's an only fools and horses joke for you if you're old enough. <laughs> you're probably not old enough. I don't know what my core demographic is actually. 30 minutes, I don't know if I can do it that quick. It's big, how big is it? It's four or five burgers tall. Four or five, that doesn't sound too big. No. Does it come with plenty? I'm just gonna go like, could you do it? I reckon so, what do you think? This is a picture of the, the last bloke to attempt it. That's, that's a pretty pitiful effort. I've seen some, some bad attempts at food challenges, but that is up there. Looks like he just took the burger apart and then walked away from the table. You just sold me out to the waitress. She knows who I am now. They're gonna make it twice as big. Are you guys doing sweeps over here? Yeah, we're doing sweeps, 20 can, can, can I get in on it? Uh, Loza is uh, 20, 27 minutes what is and it? Ryan's 32 minutes and 38 seconds. What is it, 20p? 20p. Put me down for 19 minutes. 19 minutes? <laughs> You get 40 minutes to finish the challenge, so hopefully I can do it and avoid a ticket at the same time. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at the chips. The chips are gonna kill me. There you go, enjoy. Thank you very much. Now you've seen it, what, what do you reckon? We got a challenge up for him. So today I'm at a place called The Lord Rodney and uh, I'm taking, does it have a special name or just The Burger Challenge? The Burger Challenge. Just The Burger Challenge. And uh, it's not been defeated yet. Uh, it costs, how much is the price? 20 pounds. 20 quid? So that's a bargain for this amount of food. If you finish it inside 40 minutes, yeah. it's on the house. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. Um, and I think they've got sweeps on me. Somebody said 22 minutes or something. I don't think it'll be that quick. But, and the drink is included, right? You have yeah, to finish the drink? Yeah. I'm surprised this is managed to stay erect. For, for uh, I don't know why I said that. <laughs> Shoot, whatever you're ready. Right, three, two, one, go. All right, let's get started. I, I probably should start, I'm, I might leave the burger. I'm gonna start with the chips. I don't normally do this, but there are lots of them. What's up, Benami, welcome back to another episode with your friendly neighborhood tater hater. Oh, the burger's gonna fall. I dropped some chips, picked them up though. <laughs> Five second rule. Yeah, that's probably more like 15 seconds, but who's counting? They should probably extend that rule actually, given the current economic climate. Anyway, as you can see, I abandoned the fries first stratagem in favor of a much more traditional meat first approach. And so far, it seems to be working quite well. Fried chicken. Yeah, and the fried chicken was surprisingly good. Crispy on the outside, succulent in the middle, just the way you want it. In fact, everything in the burger tower was, was great. Could have used a bit of sauce though. The lights can be all over the place in this video, but I'll try and make it look as good as I can. <sighs> Improvised chip sandwich. Yeah, it's a lot of chips. Yeah. Oh, just for me? How thoughtful. How thoughtful. I did a kilo of chips in the last one, the Gatsby Sandwich Challenge. Can't escape them. All right, the burger's done. It's a kilo of chips. Yeah, kilo of chips. We're going to lube these suckers up. How much coleslaw? It looks like it's about a pound of coleslaw. Yeah, half a kilo, Alan. Yeah, half a kilo is roughly a pound, so I eyeballed that coleslaw pretty well. Come on, we could do it. Whoa, Nelly, seven minutes is a bit early for a pep talk. 
That said, looking back at this tree, it doesn't really surprise me that I had to psych myself up a bit. And these things were like, they were like pure shards of starch. They were not pleasant to eat. And I didn't even really let them cool that long, to, to be honest. Starting the Diet Coke early because this is actually included. You, you, you don't win unless you finish the pint of Coke. The hardest thing here is that they're just really crispy chips, so you can't really boil them up and stuff them down. There's still time, still time, old boy. I think we both know that the, uh, the fork probably isn't gonna last too long, but uh, I, just, oh, I just dropped some chips. I dropped a handful of chips again. Yeah, yummy. What's the only thing worse than chips? That's right, floor chips. <laughs> Do you have any, uh, any kind of sauce, like mayonnaise or anything like that? Um, lots of mayonnaise, please. Does anyone know how long I've been going? <coughs> oh, 28 minutes left. That's all right. Because it's so crispy, you can't, <coughs> you can't really, you know, crunch them up. Normally, I'd be disgusted and, you know, crush them into a ball like, like that. There's no real give to them. Yeah, I'm prone to exaggerating, but this was like eating flipping wood chips or something. They were rock hard. Okay. <laughs> 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 yeah, that wouldn't have been a bad idea. By the way, I, I don't know why I went with mayonnaise. In retrospect, something fruity would probably have been a better choice to help with the, the flavor fatigue, but you know me, master tactician, I am not. Still, I'm starting to see the bottom of the tray now, which is uh, a relief to say the least. <sighs> I need to change tack here. This is taking forever. There we go. I am what I am. Why fight it? Let's get down and dirty. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I tried to resist the urge to do this for as long as I could, but you can't do this with a fork. It's impossible. <laughs> I'm starting to groan with, with real anguish now. In truth, I probably could have done it with a fork. It would have just taken way longer. Do you know how much, how long are, how, About 20 minutes left. 20 minutes left. Yeah, that's a bit misleading. More like 17 and a bit minutes. But uh, plenty of time, plenty of time left. I zoom in. <laughs> I zoom in that my mouth can take the punishment. I never want to see a ship again. <sighs> that was, uh, that was chip, not ship, by the way. I've got nothing against naval vessels, pleasure cruisers, anything like that. <laughs> It's the, uh, the rock hard fried taters I take issue with. Luckily, we're now onto the onion rings, which were much softer, though still substantial, uh, but they were a much more pleasant way to, to finish up. I was ways off with the, the sweep steak, though. I lost out on that one. What did I say, 19, 19 minutes? A country mile away. Still, we're, uh, we're getting it done. That's, that's the important thing. And uh, just a, a little bit of debris, some coke to go. Hope you enjoyed it, and I'll catch you at the next one. I don't know who's winning. Who's winning the sweep? My mouth hurts so much now. Um, do you guys have a dessert menu? Yes, sir. Keep over! Keep over! Can't beat a little bit of chocolate fudge cake, some caramel ice cream. Are you guys still fighting over the, uh, the sweepstake? <laughs> That was a savage amount of chips. I'm just hoping I've not got a ticket now. Hey! Lucky day.